How is everybody doing? Hope you're all well. We're going to take a look at the two tremolo units that Boss have produced. On the left there's the PN2 tremolo pan and on the right there's the TR2. The PN2 was manufactured from May 1990 until around 1995. These are quite rare now. Um, it's the first tremolo unit that Boss ever um, manufactured as a compact. Um, you've got two inputs and two outputs. It's also a pan in there. So if you put it into two amplifiers, you'll get a nice stereo shimmer from it. Controls here, um, you've got a rate and there's a pulsating light on the left. Then you've got your depth and then there's a mode. Um, you've got a pan, sawtooth and a square wave, and you've got a tremolo, sawtooth and a square wave. The TR2 is pretty basic, it's just got input and output, mono. Um, this one is an early production model, um, I think early 98, uh, only about six months into the run I'd say. Um, there is a volume drop when you uh, engage the actual effect. Um, a lot of people find this irritating, uh, but Boss have since rectified the problem. So this one's very simple. On the left you've got the rate, and then you've got um, a kind of a hybrid knob. And if it's uh, counterclockwise, you've got the saw toot uh, in the middle. It's kind of between the two. And when you turn it fully clockwise, it's got the square wave. And then you've got the depth on the right. For this demo, I'm going to use my Fender Highway 1 Telecaster through my Fender 007 bass breaker head and cab. Okay, this is the clean signal. First up is the PN2. In the sawtooth mode, everything is at 12 o'clock. Next is the uh, TR2, everything is more or less a 12. Try the uh, square wave on this one.
You nearly have a slow gear going on there. <laughs> okay, uh, next. Um, a square wave of this fella. pretty cool these are very easy to find um, you can also modify the older ones so that the volume doesn't drop I don't really notice it here now uh, hang on. No, no if you use a compressor I don't think it really makes much difference um, yeah it's pretty cool so there you go and uh, this guy's a little bit rarer um, you're gonna pay um, a bit of cash for this fella because uh, they're they're like I said they're rare and they're sought after. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, feel free to subscribe and take care.